the Defense Science Board inside the Pentagon has proposed a terrifying way to fight evildoers, goad them into making terrorist attacks. United Press International says that preemptively provoking responses from adversary terrorist groups could include stealing their money or tricking them with fake communications. The Moscow Times offers further possibilities, such as killing family members and infiltrating the groups with provocateurs who will suggest and even direct terrorist strikes. Once the terrorists have been provoked, what then? UPI says that by taking action, the terrorists would be exposing themselves to quick response attacks by U.S. forces. In other words, the plan is to hit the hornet's nest with a stick while waiting nearby with a can of bug spray. The flaws in this approach are obvious. Although not spelled out in the UPI article or the report itself, the idea seems to be that the proactive preemptive operations group will cause terrorists to make an attack but supposedly stop them right before the attack actually occurs. Will the HEPROACTIVE preemptive operations group always be able to prevent terrorism it creates from taking place? Will it always be able to neutralize all of the terrorists during that crucial window after a plan has been put into motion but before it's been carried out? I wouldn't want to bet lives on it. But that's exactly what's happening.